hi, welcome to another video. Here is a quick update video on what happened in the last 24 hours at Starbase. The Raptor maintenance platform which was unfolded yesterday to apply paints was later folded back up and put on its support stand. That is a big, big table right there. If you are wondering how would this table work, here is an animation of how it might work under the orbital launch mount to get access to the engine bay of the booster. Late at night, a Raptor engine was spotted leaving the production tent and headed inside the Mega Bay, where Booster 7 is undergoing repair. Does this mean Booster 7 is still in consideration to be the first booster to fly? It is unclear if it was a new Raptor or one of the 13 Raptors removed from the booster. It is hard to tell. But I mean why would they install a new Raptor anyway if Booster 7 is going to be scrapped? So, I think Booster 7 will definitely make an epic comeback. One of the motors was lifted and removed from the orbital tank farm. Not sure if it wasn't needed anymore or if it stopped functioning. Although it looks a little bit toasty from the explosion, crews could be seen working throughout the whole night on the orbital launch mount. Lately, chopstick arms also have been getting some attention. Multiple man lifts could be seen working on it. Well, that is it for now. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for daily SpaceX-related update videos.